How do you win in life, in my opinion, in the eight ballers opinion? You got to do something, first of all, you're good at. You know, many people in this world have a talent, but for some reason, and this includes me, you start redirecting your attention where you're not good at something. I have no idea. Sometimes life gets in the way. You have to get an immediate job. And obviously the job that you get is not truly the job you want to do. You don't love doing it. You're not super talented doing it, but you need to survive. There's all types of reasons. Or sometimes you just get sidetracked. Something that could be a health. It could be a family issue. It could be a relationship issue. <laughs> sometimes we get sidetracked. I, I mean, listen, it happened to me a million times. You know, when I was a young kid, you know, I'm talking like a teenager, you know, my whole dream was to be a musician, but you know, it wasn't paying the bills. And my wife, well, not my wife, she was my girlfriend at the time. She wanted a future, you know, you know, by the time I was in my like mid 20s, she's like, you know, got to get like a, a job. I wound up getting involved with sales and I stuck with that for a long time. But you see how you could get sidetracked, you know, um, I'm not bad at sales, don't get me wrong. I'm a really good salesman, but I, in my heart, I wanna be, be a musician, I wanna be a piano player. And now that I'm 46 years old, I'm old now. <laughs> I say I wanna, I wanna focus on what I'm good at, which is being a piano player, being a musician, being a songwriter. And again, I do write lyrics. I don't consider myself a good singer at all. I sing more or less for fun. Piano player, I'm very serious. I'm a very serious piano player. And the like writing instrumental music. And I really want to focus my time on that. But that's how I think you become successful. You got to go through the hard knocks. You got to be willing to just go through the ups and the downs. But you should really stick to what you love. And you should stick to what you know you're talented at. And what you're truly good at. And sometimes that's a hard decision. Because you get sidetracked. And life gets in the way. But you have to try to fight through it. You have to really try to fight through it. Because it's always going to be calling to you. You know, my, the piano always calls to me. There's times I go away from it because I'm focusing on other things in my life. But the piano, it's like that song by Billy Joel, you know, Baby Grand. It calls to me. It says, come back to me, Ape Father. Come back to me. Baby, come back. And I did come back. I'm back, piano. B for victory. God bless all of you. I wish you all the best of health, happiness, and success. But just in my opinion, I'm not giving you any type of financial advice. This is not financial advice. Everything I say is subject to my own opinion for entertainment purposes only. But I think you, you know, if you really want to be happy in life and if you really want to succeed, you should do what you're very, very good at. You understand? You got to do what you know you're good at, what you have talent at, and do what you love. Not financial advice, entertainment purposes only. From the greatest entertainer who's ever lived on planet Earth and the entire universe. The one, the only, a father in the house, baby. What?